What's up guys, for today's video I'm going to show you five very unique products. Let's see what I found today. So I found this thing on uh, TikTok and Instagram going pretty viral. This is a uh, money soap. There's uh, two kind of similar brand, maybe logo just changed, maybe the same brand. I'm not really sure, but as you can see, you wash your hands and a reward after a while, you'll get one, five, 10, 20, or even a $50 bill. So I got nine money soaps over here. Let's open them up and see if they all going to be a dollar. I hope I get at least a $5 bill. I spend about, 12 to 20 dollars for each. I got them on eBay. Uh, each seller is obviously different. So I wanted to see if I'm going to get something good. By the way guys, it's obviously not made to be gambling with soap. It's telling you pretty much, wash your hands and you get a reward with money from a dollar and up to a 50. But it also does not tell you what your chances are or odds are to get higher bills. So that's kind of a little bit disappointing. So anyways, I know that it can crack in half pretty easily. There you go. So in a way you get out right here, two pieces of soap bar. Boom. Wow, check this out. Will we get a 50? Oh no, it's a dollar. But honestly, I'm expecting to get every single one of them as a dollar. And spin it and surprise, surprise, we got here a dollar. You know what? I'm kind of not sure about this quality of the soap. It's more like a little gimmick. I think this is just a funny gift, if anything, but I wouldn't expect more than a dollar to win, but it will be still very nice if we get a 50 in here. And surprise, surprise, we get another dollar. Boom, but still it's pretty satisfying and fun to look for money inside of the soap. This has got to be the weirdest product out there. Remember, the idea of it is not to open it, but use it as a reward and... Ooh, I feel like there's two bills. No, that's just a piece of soap inside here. False alarm. Surprise, surprise, another dollar. Okay, let's keep looking. Another dollar. So remember they were saying there's chances you're going to win more than a dollar. They didn't tell us the odds, but so far odds is definitely not in your favor to get more than a dollar. And it's really annoying to open them up from the tape or whatever there is. Yep, just a single down. That one is super soapy. Let's open up this burn. Let's see if we get lucky. You see how it's a different color? This one is way easier to unbox. Ooh, nice! Guess what guys, this box is way better than this box. Maybe somebody just made a similar one and it's a fake one and they ripping off people with only a dollar now. Guess what, we got a payback. We got a $10 bill back and that's awesome. I honestly did not expect for it to hit anything. I expect to get only a dollar from each one of them because I only bought nine soaps. But looks like I hit a mini jackpot, $10. Wow, is it 50? Feels like a dollar, but I don't know, could be wrong. My hands are so soapy, it's so hard to open things now. Yep, it's only a dollar. Now you know guys, if you wanna give somebody a gift of this soap money, make sure you buy this brand, not this one. Surprise, surprise, this brand is only give us a dollar maximum. Okay, let's see what we got in this one. A dollar! Whoa, that's a lot of tape on this one. 
I tell you what guys, this is a lot of fun making this kind of videos. Another dollar and a last soap. Let's see if we're going to get lucky. Okay. Already removed this package in a little bit. And we got here one more dollar. So I guess that's your odds, at least in my case. I don't know. Not going to do it on big scale. I just think it was a funny product. And on the positive side, your wallet is going to smell good now too. For the next gadget, this is a drink to mask. Check this out. This is kind of hilarious. Instead of opening it and lifting it and drinking it, you have a little like a bottle open over here so that way you can drink to it. First complaint, it's kind of too small. It should be way bigger. Kind of not covering up my whole face or nose. But there you go. You got your hair mask. I can feel it, the air coming out mostly from my nose, so it could have been much tighter over here, but oh well. So, you want to drink something? How do you open this? Oh, you gotta go up on one of them. Boom. So, I right here, little hole for your mouth to put a bottle to or a store to. When you don't drink it, you just close it. Let's start to drink a little bit of water over here. Obviously, the bottle will work, or the store will work. It works! This is so, so funny. I got to drink some water without taking off the mask. But I'll tell you what, guys. I don't think this is from, like, microbes. It's probably mostly from the dust and stuff like that. Uh, this is just hilarious. I don't think I will ever use it. You can even hear me better whenever I open it like that. This is funny. For the next gadget, I got here for five bucks cleaning compound gel for like keyboards, electronics, whatever. I seen the people even use it for the cars too. I had this thing for like at least a couple of years. Ooh, look at that. It's like a slime. And I always put away, but now it's time. Wow, that is a slime. I, what's wrong with it? Honestly, I feel like it's just gonna make my keyboards greasy and messed up. I don't know if it just expired or something, but look at that. This is slime, not gel. And it's making my hands slimy. I got my MacBook Pro over here to try to clean up something. Let's try it out. And yeah, look at that. It definitely makes my hands super slimy. This is a total fail of the product. I am not making my keyboard slime. Look at that, the pieces of slime stayed on it. Oh. So, guys, if you wanna buy some slime and play with it, there you go. It's more like a slime. It's not cleaning gel, in my opinion. I have made lots of slime back in the day, and this is definitely feels like slime to where you have a lot of residue. This I think super cool, it's sold on Etsy, handmade, also on eBay. This is a real doll spikes, but guess what, somebody, I guess, makes them into the knives. Not really sure if they're going to get rusted easily, but I think they're so cool. Look at that, they've been twisted up the metal here from an old rusty real old spike. You got one of this, this one is much longer, Duggar style. I had it for a while. And it's highly, highly oiled when I received it. I guess you'd have to keep it highly oiled unless if you don't mind this knife's looking a little rusty and you just sharpen them up. I guess this one could be a little bit more sharpened up. And then there's this design. There's so many different designs that are popular. This is double-sided, except this one much sharper than this edge. But look at that. At the end over here, there is even markings of old railroad spike. I just think this is so cool. And there's a big one, double blade, super unique. I love the handwork over here. And the last one, I don't know who needs a knife like that, but there you go. And for the last one, you know I collect silver coins and stuff like that. This is such a unique product in a silver industry. They said here is um, nine mint and two toy ounces, but 
What's so different about this one? It's a spinner. I have a lot of spinners. I have put to the test so many of them throughout the years, but they just found the metal and stuff like that. These ones are actually highly valuable because it's pure silver, 999, and then you can spin them and play with them. So I think this is one of a kind product, as you can see having a mirror, parabolic mirror is way cooler when you have spin tops, because this is very, very valuable spin tops made from precious metals. Like regular silver bars or silver coins, you can just stack them, that's it, to resell them. It's just like a little investment or a really cool gift. This side here even cooler because you get to invest it and play with that. So I think that would make it a really cool gift. Well guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's unique weird products. Let me know in comments below what do you think. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe for more and I'll see you next time.